What's going on, guys? Right away here, and welcome back to the channel. I'm sorry I did not upload yesterday. I actually had to go ahead and get surgery on one of my tooths that are, like, way here in the back. It was just, like, oh, destroyed, and, like, it was just causing me problems, so they had to, like, surgically remove the tooth. That's why I did not make a video yesterday, because I was, like, all numb and stuff. I'm still a little sore, but I'm feeling a lot better. Make sure to go down below and just drop a quick like, man. One like equals one rip for my damn tooth back here. But I'm feeling a lot better, and we are back here on Black Ops Cold War. Now, as of, like, literally a minute ago, uh, as I'm recording this video two brand new bundles just went live in the store and one of the bundles is called shock value and it contains the street sweeper shotgun which is the mid-season or like the the brand new dlc weapon in black ops cold war this weapon was like teased a while ago when season one was starting and also this weapon kind of got like leaked and you were able to use it in warzone two weeks ago or something you were able to like literally unlock this gun in warzone and use it for like a little bit Treyarch ended up like patching it and now you couldn't unlock it for like a while we're gonna be buying this bundle and seeing how how the brand new shotgun is today of course guys for purchasing anything in the item shop because we also got two brand new bundles today make sure to use my support a creator code it is raid r-a-i-d make sure to put in this code before purchasing any of the brand new bundles the second bundle we got today was actually a mastercraft bundle for the ak-74u now i'll show you guys right here it's like a toy gun literally i probably won't use this gun in today's video but i'll probably showcase it in tomorrow's video i think just because i really want to make a video and just kind of focus on the brand new shotgun here i'm pretty sure this variant unfortunately doesn't have like any tracers or like any kind of like shock electric dismemberment you know effects or anything like that when you kill someone and also if you didn't know the street sweeper is now in cold war so you can unlock it for free just by doing the challenge you don't need to buy the bundle so to unlock the street sweeper it says using shotguns get three kills without dying in 15 different matches i'm pretty sure this is the same challenge if you're playing Warzone too yeah if you don't want to buy the bundle you just want to unlock the new shotgun for free just do the challenge you have a quick dot led we have the 14.6 ranger we have the steady aim laser which is not too bad we have the 18 round drum magazine which is awesome and for the stock we have the combat stock all right so not that bad of attachments to be honest also i might as well add the accessory that came with it this little like electric ball thing might as well do that all right guys we're gonna hop into a game check out the brand new street sweeper dlc weapon if you guys enjoy make sure to drop a like and subscribe to the channel if you guys are brand new on the road to 2 million subscribers and with all that being said let's jump right into it all right ladies and gentlemen so as you can see today we have the street sweeper shotgun it's a brand new dlc weapon that just came out and yo i'm trying to showcase the weapon can you just chill on me real quick so i'll be honest with you guys i just got done finishing you know recording a video for the street sweeper shotgun like i recorded a whole video about it i also got on some really really great streaks with the shotgun but the footage it was weird like the footage just kind of got like corrupt and it really really sucks that that happened but we're here and we're recording another video with the street sweeper shotgun so let's get it yeah, it's pretty awesome that this shotgun just came out though because uh i think they kind of teased it like a while ago like i kind of said in the beginning of the video they like teased it and you were able to kind of unlock it in war zone but then they didn't int intentionally release the shotgun right so it was kind of like unintentionally they released it and they ended up like patching it and then they kind of removed it from everyone's account you couldn't use the street sweeper anymore but now it's back it's officially released now from Treyarch, and it's, it's not gonna go away which is awesome okay get off me Oh my god. No, nah, this thing is disgusting. This thing is gross, man. So yeah, feel free to, you know, do the challenge to unlock the shotgun for free. It's definitely a pretty insane weapon, to be honest with you guys. It's really like a two-shot kill, I'm pretty sure. One, two, three. Okay, three from range, two from up close, which is insane. I think this is gonna be, like, the brand new, like, meta when it comes to, like, secondaries, because everyone always rocked, like, a shotgun secondary, like, the Gallo or something like that, but I think this is, like, gonna be the brand new, like, meta when it comes to, like, you know, secondaries and shotguns and everything like that. You're just chilling upstairs in the corner. Like, hello. We got one more dude in here. Let's go. Got you. Perfect. Excellent. We're killing. Okay, but you guys have to see the reload on this thing. Are you ready? I don't think you guys are ready for the reload on this weapon. No, it's still going, people. It's still going. So, yeah, the reload on this shotgun is absurdly long. Okay, are you just AFK? Okay, I'm gonna get you. There's a dude, like, waiting for me out here. Yeah, I had to pull out my AK. He was, like, just watching me, which was so sus. Oh, my gosh. Hello? All right, we're gonna kill you. We're getting on a mini streak. We're getting on a little streak. We got the war machine. Hold on. Come through. Come through. There's one, like, down below. Hello? What are you doing? Okay, good. We're good. We're on a nine. We're on a nine, boys. Let's keep this streak alive, okay? And also, like I just mentioned, I just got surgery on my... Oh, okay. What? CMR. 
I just got two tapped by the DMR. And also, guys, like I mentioned in the beginning of the video, I just got surgery on my tooth. The surgery wasn't that bad, but I appreciate all of, like the love on Twitter and stuff like that because you guys sent like awesome tweets to me. If you guys don't follow me on Twitter, definitely do so already. Oh my god, I just went in right there. Definitely follow me on Twitter. I was tweeting about how I had to get surgery on my tooth. It wasn't like my wisdom teeth or anything. It was just like a really, really bad tooth that I had to get like removed essentially. Yeah, I do have some stitches in my mouth. I, I honestly probably shouldn't even be like talking right now. That's the thing. I should not even be like talking. Oh my god. But you know what? We gotta make some videos, man. We, we gotta make videos. We gotta make content. So. so a new DLC weapon came out. We gotta make a video. I was like completely numb yesterday and I just couldn't make a video like at all. So that's why I didn't upload. I'm feeling a lot better today. The numbness is obviously down and we can record. What am I doing right now, guys? Hey, I'm just going in. Bruh, what is it? I'm on a 17, guys. But yeah, this is the street sweeper shotgun, the striker, whatever you want to call it. It's literally the striker and like all past Call of Duty games. This shotgun is disgustingly over. No, no, no. Call of Duty is broke. No, Call of Duty is done. Old War is legit broken right now, man. I didn't actually get a chance to unlock this thing in Warzone and like you know, do the challenge when it was accidentally, you know, went live. On top of the Brecky PTSD, I, I, my, my tooth, I just had surgery on my damn tooth. Let me get you. Okay. I'm pulling out my AK-47. I'm sorry. We got this guy in the middle. Let me know in the comment section what, like, past DLC weapons or past weapons you guys want to see in Black Ops Cold War as, like, you know, DLC weapons. Oh my god, I'm on a 25. Wait. Is this so... There's someone upstairs. Oh my god, I'm on a 26. No way. No way. I have a war machine and we're on a 26. Is this the nuclear? I think we're gonna flip spawns. Wait, we got a guy like right here. Let's go. 27 with the harp. Come on. Let's go. Got him? Anyone here? They have spawn protection. I'm on a 29. Wait. Wait. Oh my god, I'm on a 29. I'm one off the nuke. I have spawn protection, right? They're gonna have spawn protection. We gotta wait. We gotta wait. This guy's coming around, right? Come on. Come on. Yes, nuclear, what? Okay, so if you guys missed the level 1000 video that I posted like two days ago, I actually ended up dropping a nuclear in that video. Before that nuclear gameplay, guys, I haven't dropped a nuclear on Cold War in probably like two weeks to a month. I am not even joking to you guys. I don't drop nuclears in every single one of my videos. I used to stress really, really hard about dropping nuclears and dropping like the best gameplays for you guys. More or less in my videos, I just show you just fun and really nice streaks that I think are cool. And I kind of stopped stressing about dropping nuclears in, you know, Cold War just for my videos. Honestly, it's it's pretty much because this shotgun is just so disgustingly overpowered. As you can see, the range is disgusting. I'm sorry if the commentary was also like all over the place in this video. Like I said, I told you guys, I recorded a full video right before this. So I'm kind of happy that my footage got corrupted. Now, oh my gosh. I actually ended up playing again and I dropped a nuclear with this thing. So I think I dropped a really awesome gameplay for you guys in this video. I'm so happy. In my opinion, it's probably going to be really hard to use this shotgun on like other maps. Like maybe Raid would be good, but I think Nuketown's probably going to be the most insane map for this shotgun. You're probably going to be seeing the shotgun every time you play Nuketown now. Which honestly, I'm not too happy about because I'm not really a fan of like spammy shotguns or spammy weapons like this. Oh my god. Okay, chill on me. But at the same time, I'm like scared for like the state of Cold War multiplayer because, you know, everyone just uses shotguns. We knew that. Like this guy is using a shotgun. He's got Plague Diamond and everything. But I'm pretty scared because this is a new shotgun. People are going to use it because it's new. And it's very, very spammy and overpowered. It has 18 bullets in the magazine. The range is amazing. The damage is amazing. Like, I'm, I'm honestly just really, really scared for the state of Cold War multiplayer after the release of this shotgun today. I hear this dude. Boom, get off me. This thing is just disgustingly broken. I can't believe they released this shotgun, man. Look at that. Hello? Oh my god. Did I just kill that man? Really? But I hope you guys enjoyed today's video. This shotgun is absolutely broken. Thank y'all so much for watching today's video. If you guys enjoyed, drop a like, subscribe to the channel. And of course, if you guys are in the store purchasing any of the brand new bundles, make sure to use my support a creator code. It is RAID, R-A-I-D. Thank you guys all so much for the love and support, and I'll catch you guys in the next video.